if you have a chance to go back with your birth mom, would you go? Do you remember what it was like meeting your adoption siblings for the first time? Do you still talk to your birth mom? What was your name before you were adopted? Yeah. Fresh vet. We overseas with this one, man. Get busy. Get busy. Everybody get, get busy. I need y'all to report to the dance floor, right? This minute. change our name adoption Q&A video and we have journey journey for our last one we saved the best for last I exactly think, right yes. okay and her name we'll give you a hint is Russian because she is from Russia Russia so for sure she changed her name and we will let you know what that is later all right we're starting with our first question journey do you still know Russian and would you want to visit Russia that's two questions do you still know Russian? Um, a little bit, couple words, not like whole sentences. She remembered Russian for about, I don't know, maybe six months, nine months, and then... Maybe. Yeah, and I kind of lost it. Kind of lost it a little yeah. bit after that. I bet you, though, if she studied it, she would pick it up fast. Yeah. Yeah. She still has that accent. I don't know if you can tell, but her voice is very low. <laughs> and it's very serious. Exactly. So even when she says, I am very happy, it sounds like she is very serious about being happy. <laughs> I love her accent. It's very elegant. Yeah. Makes you sound very grown up. <laughs> Would you want to visit Russia? Yes, because to see how it is and see how it... Like the culture? Yeah, like the culture. And no, because it brings out bad memories. Yeah, a little bit of bad memories, huh? Yeah. So. Yeah, I can see that. So yes and no. Good yeah. answer, Journey. Where in Russia are you from? It's a little town called Holy. Holy. She's from an orphanage there in Holy. It's about five hours outside of Moscow. So, perfect. If you have a chance to go back with your birth mom, would you go? P.S. I love you guys so much. That question, the answer is a firm no. Firm no. Because I don't even know who my birth parents are. Yeah, it's a little tricky. Yep. And we'll tell you more about just her situation when she is brought to the orphanage in our uh, kind of adoption Q&A. But basically, Journey was left at home for months and months at a time and she was only 18 months old. Yep. And she was left with like a two or three year old and a four year old and they were just left to fend for themselves mm -hmm. for months at a time. So yep. I will tell you more about that. But yeah, she probably doesn't have the best of memories. No nope. there, so no. Do you like being a tomboy like Delaney or a girly girl? Love you so much, by the way. Sorry. I'm not really a girly girl. I'm more leaning of a tomboy. I like basketball, I like sports and I kinda don't like putting makeup on really that much or nail polish or whatever girls do. Yeah. Yeah, she's kind of like tomboy and also kind of a cowgirl. Yeah. She just likes to be like around animals and horses and mm -hmm. yeah, she's really good with animals. Yeah. Whoa, speaking of that, the next question is what's your favorite animal? It's a horse. 
A horse, for sure. Journey loves horses. Yeah. Do you remember what it was like meeting your adoption siblings for the first time? For me, I don't remember a whole lot. Like, it was exciting. Like, I don't didn't know who they were, but I was excited to meet them. Yeah, kind of didn't understand what was going on a lot. Yeah. Do you remember the very first night that you guys all slept on my floor of my bedroom? Yes, together? I, I remember that. <laughs> that was. I have a picture of that. Maybe yeah. I'll find it and show it. Yeah. Good times. So when Journey came, we had five other kids. So Journey was kind of number six. And so there was lots of little kids and... Mm -hmm. Yeah, and Bridger and Cassidy were her exact same age. Mm -hmm. So we basically suddenly had triplets. So, yeah. so yeah. So she had lots of friends her age to play with, and Kennedy's just one year older. So, yeah, lots of friends to play with with her siblings. All right. Did you know Bridger before you got adopted? I didn't even know who Bridger was before I got adopted. He was adopted two years before. And he is from a whole different side of Russia, kind of by yeah. St. Petersburg, but like 10 hours outside of St. Petersburg even. So yeah. they didn't know each other. No. 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 Next question. Do you still talk to your birth mom? Nope, because I don't know who she is. Yep, we don't. We've actually tried to reach out on Facebook Yeah. because we know her name, but we haven't had any response. So mm -hmm. it would be nice to find out who her birth mom was though. So if you're watching and you're from Russia, reach out to us in our comments and let us know if you want to help us find her birth mom. That would actually be really cool. Yes. Well, do you remember your birth mom? We already asked. Yeah, I don't know who she is. I don't know. All right, it says some stories in the orphanage, please. Do you have any good stories? Just one, I had a best friend. What was his name? Bova. His name was Bova. Yeah. And he was like Journey's little, I don't know, BFF. Like everywhere she went, he would walk around with his hand on her back, like make sure she was okay. And she wanted a jump rope and he ran and got her a jump rope and brought it to her. Mm -hmm. He maybe had a little crush on her or maybe it was like they were brother or sister. I don't know, but they were good friends. <laughs> we actually tried to ask the orphanage if he would be able to be adopted too because they were really close. Mm -hmm. But they said that his brother, who was already 18, was looking at possibly adopting him in a little while. And so we were able to, but yeah. But we have seen pictures of him, older, and so it's kind of fun to try to keep up on some of our friends in the orphanage, mm -hmm. right? Perfect. Do you remember what it was like seeing with crossed eyes? Sorry for the bad English. <laughs> I could only see like half of the picture, not the whole. And my eye, w my eyes would be switching on. Yeah, they switch on. So like when this eye would go inside, you couldn't really see her eyes. She'd only see this part. And then this one would switch and go inside and she would only see this part. And so sometimes she would just like run into the wall. She'd just be walking and just like run into the wall. Or like one time we were at a, a parking lot and she just square ran into a car because she couldn't see that side of it. So she's just walking and ugh, all of a sudden the car took you out. You remember that? I don't know if she remembers that. I don't think but I it was really hard for her to see. And so... Are you happy you got your surgery? Yeah. Yes, because it opened it all up and so she can see the whole big, beautiful picture, yeah. right? Yeah. yeah. What do you want to be when you grow up and why? That is a good question. And for example, this cat right here. Cat right there, see it? See it. I love animals and I want to be a vet when I grow up to take care of these kind of animals and other animals too. Yeah, she would be a really good vet. Or she's been thinking about being a Groomer. Groomer. Yeah. An animal groomer. Anything with animals. Yeah. She loves animals. And they love her. What was her first reaction when she came to the USA? Oh, that's in the adoption. Her adoption video we show coming down the escalator. You'll have to check that out. Yeah, check that out. But one of the cutest things was, do you remember hugging everybody? Yeah, I was hugging everybody. <laughs> everybody. It was so cute. She wouldn't just like hug you like, oh gosh, thanks for it. She like held you like you were her long lost friend and she hadn't seen you for years. And so like yeah. that made everybody cry. All the grandpas were crying yeah. and the grandmas were crying. Like the next week we went to a movie theater. <laughs> she came out of the bathroom stall and she hugged a stranger in the bathroom. Yeah. And I was like, no, no, Journey, come here. <laughs> so she really liked to hug people. That was yeah. her that was her first reaction. Just give everyone a hug and let them know that you love them. Even if you're a stranger in the bathroom. <laughs> Do you have a secret boyfriend in your school? Do, do, do. 
just say his nickname, maybe, so he doesn't feel like too embarrassed. His nickname? Yeah. Oh yeah, Will. Will. His, his name was Will. His name is Will. Yeah. <laughs> she has a pretty big crush on him, and he has a crush on her. Yeah. Not really a secret, because she told us it was a secret for about a day. Yeah. But then she shared it with all of us. Yeah. Yeah. So we'll see where that goes. But for right now, they're really cute little friends, and they like each other. Yeah. All right, Journey, are you ready? For yes. the big, the huge, the monstrous question of yes. all of them. What was your name before you were adopted? And you have to say the whole big beautiful name. So uh, this is kind of hard to pronounce for everybody that's not Russian or anybody that ever heard it, but my Russian name was Kuklova Ludmila Valentinova. Kuklova, Ludmila, Valentinova. So what did they call you for short? Lud. Lud. They yeah. called her Lud for short. Yeah. Pretty name. Yeah. Very pretty. Yeah. And now, what is your name now? My name is Journey Michelle Nelson. Journey Michelle Nelson. Woo! And Woo. Michelle, Michelle, the meaning of Michelle means that angel. And when I first saw Journey in the orphanage is when I came up with that middle name because she looked like a little angel. So sweet, just yeah. beaming with this cute little light and just looked so, I don't know, like a little angel. So yeah. Michelle is her middle name mm -hmm. for angel. Well, that was easy. How was that, CUNY? That was good. That was pretty good. Yeah. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you like these Q&As and you want us to do some Q&As for the kids who aren't adopted, give us a big thumbs up and we'll know that you want to see those as well. Subscribe down below. Hit the notification bell. And follow us on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter. Oh, Twitter, why do our kids keep saying Twitter? We don't even have a Twitter, but you or can follow us on TikTok. TikTok. <laughs> Thank you. Bye.